whatever you might have heard. You dare try and deny it. I heard it straight from the horse's mouth. Michael said Yeah, this. romping. They were on that tatty old set here of ours. Romping. I almost caught him at it. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing, Gail? Washing like I had a shampoo, yeah? Gail, you better put them down. You should have put my husband down. But no, pawing at him you were like a grizzly on it. Oh, now wait a minute. Why should I? You didn't. First chance you got, you pounced on him. He didn't stand a chance. Now, hold on. Michael is no victim. No, you have killed him on that settee. I mean, talk about a praying mantis. I don't know why you just didn't gobble him up and have oh, done no, it. No, hey, no, you no, mad no, cow! No, Audrey, no, help! You're all right, man. I can manage on my own. Look, yeah, will you stop oh. this, please? It was a moment of madness. It meant absolutely nothing. It meant nothing? Not a thing. Are you telling me you have no feelings for my husband? If? I mean, no, I mean, well, he's not my type. But you knew he was my type. My husband, who I love. And that's why you did it, to spite me, you vicious... Oh, oh, no! Ow! Oh, 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 I oh, 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 you oh, 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 stay it. where you are if you know oh, what's good for you. You need locking up if you do! Out! I swear I'm going to call the police. I mean it. What the... After a new boyfriend, are you? It was the fire brigade last time. No wonder they call it the emergency services. You are going to let me walk away while I still have my dignity and you still have your teeth. Ow! Right. I have given you fair warning. Do something! Oh, 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 all right, all right, all right, take oh. your... Oh, 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 oh. Look what you've done to my jacket. Oh. Well, I've done you a favour, because you look like wee Jimmy Cranky. What's going on? Since when did these two ever need an excuse? She kissed Michael. Oh. I know you're desperate, Mother, but that's practically grave robbing. What was it, the kiss of life with benefits? A kiss of death, more likely. She nearly killed him off. I'm not surprised, mind you, slobbering over him's enough to put any bloke in intensive hell. Oh, 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 oh. Therapy. I won't go there for a night out, but it were all right. A lot calmer than the first one, anyway. Less fun. I don't know. I think I've had enough of that kind of fun to ask me a lifetime. I mean, when your mum gets started, she just she's let me get a lot at her. You said yourself you didn't love him. Of course I don't. Otherwise, I wouldn't have sent him back to you. I think I want your leftovers. My lord, you say? What's going on? Michael and Eileen have been, er... Uh... No way! How many times? Nothing like that happened! Uh, well, she would say that, wouldn't oh, she? Oh, sure up, you! You're as bad as her! The rotted apple didn't fall far from the tree! Oh, yeah, well, where is your David? is just a prince amongst men! Hang on, don't drag me into this! No, mind you, she, she does have a point. Oh, shut up, you! I mean, I thought you were scraping the bottom of the barrel with Barney McGrew with his missus sleeping in the next room, but this... This is a new low. Who's Barney McGrew? Oh. I mean, I know he walks upright and he's breathing. Just. But even for you, it's not a good catch, is it? I mean, he's a failed burglar with a dodgy heart and a fondness for white fronts. Gail, we're too much in for. I mean, you can't half pick him. Hang on a minute. You married him. Yeah, a fat lot of good it did me. No, no. Carry on. It's good to know where I stand.